I've been drawing and painting ever since I was a little kid, and I always loved kind of to create my own world. I felt safe when I was like making something and sort of forgetting about how things really are. So it was like kind of like a make-believe fantasy that I always wanted to do. I'm drawn to painting surfing is because that's what I've done since I was pretty little, like maybe like 12 or 13, and it's what I wanted to do most in the world, and so I kind of took my two favorite things and did them together. So I kind of figured it out pretty quickly that that's what I want to do, and I just kind of kept at it and never thought that I couldn't do it. I just sort of did it. I saw a bunch of Jack's early films and I really liked what he was doing. I thought I loved just his sense of taking a risk and doing something that he thought was interesting and that it wasn't a corporate sponsored movie. It was all his time and money and energy and his vision and I liked that it was sort of chaotic and crazy and abstract and but I loved his music choice. And I love the people that he chose to film, or a lot of my friends, and I like the way they surf. And so I just reached out to him and just sent him an email and just said, hey, I love your movies, right on, keep making them. And he wrote me back and we became friends and he's like, oh, I got another movie I'm working on. And so we did some animation for that. It was like a wave of Alex and we kind of had this textured background. And so that was, that was Secret Sound Underground. And then Groove Move came out last year and I he called me up and he's like, hey, I got my new movie, let's do some stuff. And so I did all the titles and text for it and then we did some animation. And, and then when Jack sort of gave us the part of where the animation was gonna fit and it was some waves of Rasta, he showed me the waves and I kind of just kept looking up at this painting that I had made and I'm like, let's do that. Let's, there's no wave, there's no board let's make this crazy. But you get the sense of motion and, and what's happening. And so we started working on it and when it came out, it, I was pretty excited about it because I think it fit the vibe of the movie. The movie's real psychedelic and it just sort of, I don't know, it felt like pretty seamless. So yeah, I'm stoked on it.